Hello and happy July! It's July again and last year I did a whole month of vlogging for Plastic Free July trying to reduce my plastic use and this year I will be doing my top 5 of the things that I did last year that I'm still doing today. So first of all, I'm still using my water bottle. I'm still using the same bottle, same reusable ice cubes and it's worked for me really really well. I used to buy so many water bottles but now I'm just refilling this one or the other ones that I have. I've saved a lot of money as well because I'm not constantly buying water bottles when I'm on the move. My second favourite is definitely, definitely food containers. I'm taking a lunch to work every day when I go and it's saved a lot of plastic because I used to buy a meal deal with water and a lunch but now I'm reusing my lunch box. We're also meal planning and we've been doing this for about a year now and that's using containers that we can reuse if needed and that's saving us a bunch of money as well as plastic because we are bulk buying a bunch of things and that's using a lot less plastic when everything comes in big big containers instead of little ones that we purchase every week so we do about three three weeks worth of food at once. Another one of my favorites is definitely sustainable period products. Um, I did a whole video in the last one explaining which ones are available and there's been a bunch of new ones entering the market since so there's definitely something for everybody. I really enjoyed how uh, little waste it is so there's no buying new ones and there's no single use plastics in those ones anymore and I've saved a bunch of money as well, it's about £40 according to my calculations. It's a really big change to kind of take that leap but it's really been worth it for me at least. Another thing that we kept up the whole year was buying refillable bags of hand soap. Uh, we tried the bar for a little bit, it wasn't our favourite, but we have now started to buy only the big bags that we can fill our little pump and that's been really sustainable. It's still plastic but it's so much less so and we really enjoyed doing that the whole year. One of the other things is that we are still using reusable bags whenever we can and remember. Also we do a lot of home deliveries so we always get the bagless uh, delivery and have the crates carried into our home. So that's been really helpful for us. So those were my five different tips that carried on from last July to this July and I'm still using every day. We have a bunch of different resources on our website. We have the Waste Wizard, we have A World app, uh, we have Kitsch so you can head over and see what you can do this July. I'll see you next July to see what you've done, uh, see what I've carried on and have a good plastic free July.